that's pretty cool. Okay, before we start this video and get too far into it, I have something really quick I wanna share with you. Please don't fast forward or skip through this. We had a fellow writer go down and I just wanna wish him all the best, Dave Hendrickson. He is somebody who has been a big supporter of this channel. He's somebody that jumped aboard when we did the Iron Butt Association for charity and matched those subscribers. Unfortunately, he was hit by an impaired driver. They do have a GoFundMe set up for him. I'll put the link in the description down below. He was hit by an impaired driver. Is gonna require multiple surgeries before recovery so please keep them in your thoughts and I understand that right now times are a little bit tough so if for some reason you cannot donate any money to Dave and his recovery something I think would be pretty cool is if you guys want to go and check out his Instagram shoot him a message let him know that we're thinking about him his Instagram is henhouse.dave and I don't know I think it'd be kind of cool if we just reach out another fellow writer down we want to make sure he gets back to recovery so good luck dave we're thinking about you what's going on everybody it is the full throttle hog and i'm coming back to you with another video if you're not familiar with this channel we are a traveling motive vlogging channel and dabble in some cinematic adventures for your viewing experience i would be extremely grateful if you consider subscribing down below uh hit that like button and leave a comment saying you subscribed and i will get back to you and get to know you a little bit better so i went to the mailbox today and i was really excited for what i saw as you guys know i've been waiting for my iron butt association certification and it has arrived right here we're gonna take a look at it together for those of you that have been following along with this channel you know that we did the iron butt challenge which was the saddle sore 1000 it was spontaneous it was with boosted bagger we left san diego went all the way up to san francisco over the golden gate bridge and back down within that 24 hour period i documented everything i'll put the link to the video somewhere up in here if you guys want to check that out uh, and we did it for charity it was an awesome event and one of the things that it made me realize is I enjoy the long distance riding stuff. It was a lot of fun. So we're gonna go through, I'm gonna show you what you get once you have your ride certified. For me, I ordered the full Monty package just because I wanted to grab everything possible for this accomplishment. And so we're gonna dig into this envelope real quick. I got some other mail we're gonna take a look at right here. I think I know who this is from. Get a little card. So this is from Baggers and Brews. Uh, De Beard, thank you so much. Uh, send me a letter congratulating me on the thousand subscribers. Um, just thank you guys so much. If you're not checking out Baggers and Brews, you really should be. I'll put a link to their channel down in the description below as well. But thank you, Baggers and Brews, for this. I appreciate it. Now let's get into this IBA package right here. All right. Well packaged. Got a couple of envelopes within envelopes this is kind of like when you get one of those packages for christmas and it's a present within a present so let's start here and then we'll move here so inside envelope number one we have a letter from the iron butt association uh, we will get into that in a second actually we'll just go through this one at a time so it says ryan congratulations on successfully completing your long distance ride challenge you now join a small community of motorcyclists from around the world and have managed to tackle and successfully solve the challenge of time and distance to earn the enclosed ride certification. Thank you for your patience with the process. As you can see, we don't just slice open mail and issue certificates. Each ride application is put through a rigorous examination before a certification is issued. You know you did your ride, but you wanna know when you see an IBA plate back the person with that plate back or certificate was held to the same high standard you were. That is what gives the enclosed piece of paper its true value. Your ride will permanently be recognized in the Iron Butt Association's worldwide webpage at www.ironbutt.org forward slash rides and will be posted there in the next update within 60 days. It's my pleasure to welcome you to our long distance family of riders. If I can be of service, please do not hesitate to contact me. And it's from Michael J. Kneebone, uh, and he's the president of the Iron Butt Association. Appreciate that. And here it is, the certificate. This is to certify that on 16th February 2021, you rode a 2020 Harley Davidson Road Glide Special, a total of 1,109 grueling miles within the state of California in less than 24 hours, starting in Santee, continuing on to Los Angeles through San Luis Obispo, Salinas, San Francisco, San Rafael, Santa Clarita, before returning to Santee while participating in the California Saddle Soar 1000. The California Saddle Sore 1000 was conducted under very strict guidelines set forth in the Iron Butt Association. Only a handful of riders from around the world have managed to solve the challenges such a grueling ride involves. Very cool. 
actually gave gave me a couple copies. It also gives you a list of the printouts of everybody and who completed it and on what on their latest update. So that's pretty cool. So also inside of this package, they gave me a letter from the Iron Butt Association, which includes my membership ID and my password, which is awesome. Basically lets you know that you're a part of that community. Uh, you can order products and, and things like that that are strictly for people that have completed the challenge. Let's move on to envelope number two. So in envelope number two, we have, oh, the elusive unicorn Iron Butt Association backplate. This is probably the uh, the thing that most people, including myself, uh, are most excited about. So kind of cool, kind of have on the bike, kind of shows that uh, you completed that challenge. Also, Iron Butt Association, a thousand miles in California, 24 hours patch. That'll go on the vest. I like it. All right. And with that, you get your Iron Butt Association, 1,000 miles in California in 24 hours pin. Very, very cool to get all this stuff. Uh, if you guys have been looking at doing an Iron Butt challenge, uh, keep in mind there's there you can do the Saddle Sore 1000. There's also Ride 1K in a day. That's also a certification process, and they certify your ride. So I encourage you to to apply for both and get your ride certified. We'll go over in another video exactly how the certification and the documentation goes, and hopefully that will help you out with your journey. Uh, but yeah, I mean, the Iron Butt Association, it's one of those things, if you've never done it, you gotta put it on your bucket list and you have to do it. And if you are gonna go through the process, I highly recommend you just, just do the extra research on how to actually document that ride and just be a part of this amazing community. But I'm extremely excited. The Iron Butt Association certificate finally came. It does take a little bit of time. You guys need to know that. You have to be patient. Keep in mind, we did this ride in February and now we're going you know, almost to middle of May. So it does take a little bit of time to get that certificate, but it was well worth the, uh, the wait and the journey. I can't tell you enough how awesome it is to be a part of something like that and to complete that challenge challenge. Uh, a couple people have DM'd and asked, how has the diet gone? If you guys don't know, I've been on a strict diet going into the summer months because of the traveling we're going to be doing because of Sturgis. We're going to Vegas next week, a whole bunch of things coming up. So I've been on a strict diet and you can see, you know, obviously sometimes the scale, as you guys know, it can't be your best judgment. Usually it's your clothes and things like that, but the best thing is pictures. While editing just the other day, I was looking at another video, so I'll show you side by side of where I was at four weeks ago and where I'm at today. And I'm pretty excited with the progress and looking forward to summer. We're almost to the uh, the target weight so I can start participating in beer drinking and things like that. But that's gonna do it for today's video, folks. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe down below. Check out that Saddle Sore 1000 spontaneous video and we will catch you on the next one.